up in New York. Ooh. Thank you. I am wearing Laquan, custom Laquan for tonight. It's a little reminiscent of one of the suits that you actually wore in the issue. Yes, yes. The cover, um, one piece that I wore was by Laquan. Um, it was one of my favorite pieces of his that I kind of had my eyes on for a long time. And so I was really excited when we got to rock it in this shoot. And it was a perfect piece for this shoot. And he did some other pieces as well, which is really cool. So just shout out to all the designers. They literally sent over every cool piece that I could have wanted for this shoot. So that was amazing. Yeah! Denim in the water. You got to kind of, you know, put a little edge to that thing. So, yeah. And now you're telling me, I, I barely kept liking that. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. I was like, did that really just happen? Like, is that what, what you're saying to me? Say it again. Um, my president, Jordan Dinenberg, told me that Sports Illustrated wanted to have me on the cover. And I was like, wow. Like, dreams really do come true. Like, it really was. I was excited. And it was also, you know, it's like holding on to it for like six months, knowing I shot the cover was also something, too. I'm like, I can't wait to share the, with the world, my fans, this cover. It's exciting. So it's pretty amazing. Russell, no, did you shoot my Yeah, of course he did. He was the first one I told. Yeah, he was like nice. He was like, go babe. He's so supportive and, um, you know, he's just been like always supportive. So that was just the usual, but it was really exciting to share with him. And he's been on Sports Illustrated. I learned that when I told him the news, he's been on like, I don't know, at least three or four Sports Illustrated covers too. And also Ben Watts shot him on his covers. So that was pretty cool. Yeah, I think you take the cake out of <laughs> How wonderful was it so that your girl Kim is on yes. it. She's having a milestone here. Yeah. yeah. This is amazing. I thought that MJ Day had incredible vision for this magazine. You know, the whole release of all of us being on this on the on the covers. And she really wanted to push the level of diversity, diversity and inclusivity, which I thought was really beautiful and powerful. I really loved talking with her and hearing her vision that she had for women and and how she wanted for women to really be connected to the magazine and to have a different outtake or outlook on how I think we kind of perceive the magazine over the you know over years now. That's no, not to say that you can't. You have to give love and respect to all of the iconic magazines and elite women that have come before us. I mean, they all inspired us to want to be on the cover, but ultimately she wanted to kind of push the boundaries a bit more and expand. And so I was excited to be a part of that. You know, I'm probably one of the handful of women of color on this magazine and also being a mom. You know, typically you wouldn't see moms on the cover like that back in the days. Let's do you have a pregnant woman, you have yeah, these, these I'm to Yes, and that's what it's about because we are women, all of us, right? Like. I think that's so important, like, it's just beautiful and powerful what she, her vision that she has, and I think it's going to be game changing. I know it is. It's somewhat of a historic moment because now the landscape and the way that people, I think, look at Sports Illustrated Swimsuit is different, and it's a way for everyone, which is, is what it should be about, right? It's all of our, I call it my beauty marks, like my stretch marks, you know, all of like the cellulite, all that stuff, you know, I love like on the cover, there's a couple little little dimples in my tissue a little bit, which I love, but that's us. That's who we are as women, right? It's real. So, you know, MJ just had incredible vision and I'm so, so honored to be a part of it and truly proud of this moment. And it's empowering for your daughter as well. What was yes. the reaction when she My baby girl, oh, mommy, you look, you look pretty. You look, you know, CC mama, that's like the mini me. Um, and so it's really sweet. And then it's funny because my son Future was like, I can't look at that magazine. Turn that, put that magazine away. He's so funny. He doesn't like anything that's like, if mommy starts to pop it, he's like, stop it. He's that for me. So, uh, but everyone was so excited in my house as well, which is awesome. And then of course, Russ was super proud. So yeah, it's pretty sweet. Oh, you're always empowering. Did you do anything different than your regular Yes, I did. <laughs> it was honestly really intense. Getting ready for this shoot was, ooh, lordy. I mean, by the end, I was like eating everything you could imagine. Like, I was like, give me the pizza, give me the cheeseburger, give me the fries. I literally was like, I can't wait till after the shoot, we go and have a party and we go eat. That was me. Because it was really intense. I was like, this is a special moment. I got to walk in prepared. So I did work really hard, and I'm not going to lie. It was not easy to stay there. So, you know, every day is a work in progress, but really proud of this moment. Last year, before you go, your girl, Liana, just had her baby. Oh, my gosh, how amazing. Did you congratulate her? I haven't. No, I haven't spoken to her, 
but I'm excited for her. Go Riri. I mean, I remember meeting her years ago, like back when she was just getting going and I was someone in my early stages too. And it's amazing how all of us women have, you know, blossomed and like we're living our lives. It's just so beautiful and so powerful. And she's been killing it on the work side. You know, she's been grinding and inspiring so many people. And um, I'm happy for her. This is like, I say to any woman that gets a, gets a chance to have a baby, you know, in that moment, it's a very special time and it's gonna be game changing. And I'm excited for her. I know it's gonna be beautiful. And that baby's gonna be fly. I think Ree, she's gonna like, she's gonna do it the, the Bayesian way, you know, she's the Barbados, what do I say, the Bayesian, Barbados way, okay? I've, I've seen that sauce that she's got, so I think she's gonna know exactly what to do. And my mom told me, you know, when you have a baby, you're like, what is it gonna be like? What do I do? It's like, you figure it out. So she's gonna figure it out, and like I said, that baby's gonna be fly, and we know it's gonna be cute. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.